going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of Now Fish and Chill TV. Today I was supposed to go tuna fishing, but the weather went bad and today's just not a good day to do it. So I'm going to be doing some bass fishing tonight and tomorrow. So you're going to be getting a bit of a vlog. I'm going to be going into Dick's, uh, another sporting goods place other than Dick's. And then I'm going to be going to my uncle's house and he and I are going to be doing some fishing together. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Stay tuned. Alrighty guys, finally made it to Dick's Sporting Goods. I'll be taking you guys in, so let's do it. Hello. Never been in this one for fishing stuff, so interesting to see what they have. Hook fishing boots. Alright, let's see what they got. I do need some new sun coats. Very expensive here. Interesting looking bait there. Hmm. Interesting. I've really never seen before. So. Oh yeah, Tough Lion was trying to get me to try their stuff, and I was like, "Yeah, you send me some stuff for free, I'll do a product review, but I ain't buying, you know, thirty dollars spools of braid. Like that's just stupid." But if they want to help a brother out, I will be more than glad to review their stuff. But if they gonna be cheap and not send anything to me, then don't expect any of me to do you any favors. Unless you do me a favor. I'm going to give these a shot. I've never seen these before, so give them a shot. I do like Havoc stuff. They do make some pretty decent stuff. And they got different colors. They got just a green pumpkin. Just a green pumpkin. They got a black and blue. $3.00. Nine bucks plus tax. Guess that's all I'll be getting. The best kind of baits are the free ones. I got a ten dollar gift card from Dix since I spent so much money on there. In there, they always send me. Literally, it's like once a month I get a card for ten bucks because I spent so much freaking money there. They're like, yeah, hey, since you spent however much money, here's ten bucks. So. I I ain't gonna complain, I'm not gonna waste it. I go in and I buy myself freaking ten dollars worth of stuff and that was like nine fifty, so it just about broke even, so that's cool. I get to try a new bait. Never got to try it before, like I said, it's a completely new bait to me. It looks nice. I mean they they look like they're they're nice baits. They're definitely different from some from the you know, just a regular straight up Senko. They've got like some some dimples like in a, like you'd see in like a golf ball almost and uh who knows maybe that helps them like shimmy to the bottom or something like that and i noticed the tail is like really wiggly so that's really cool i'll be able to try a new different you know a new you know different kind of bait it is it's it's you know it's something that i've personally never seen before so it's different you know and it's new to me so i'm looking forward to trying it out so i guess i will see you guys when i get to the house the trap house i'm here and um yeah i'm here and i forgot to text my uncle when i was leaving so he went out to grab a couple of things so he's not here so i'm just gonna chill until he gets back so i don't know when i'll be picking up the camera next so stay tuned Alrighty, we finally made it to the water now we're just trying to find a spot where we can cast because that that is not fishing rod friendly. Oh, I had one. Dang it. Yeah, I saw the flash, and I felt the pull. Oh, 
Oh yeah. There's one. Got it. Oh my god. Oh, did he get off? Oh. Wait, hold on. Is that on? Is it on the fishing line? There was something on that fishing line. I hooked that fishing line, yeah. It just pulled it out of my hand. When I pulled it, just yanked it right out of my hand. It's right there. I hooked, well, either that or I hooked the fish and I got hooked onto it and it like came out and then it hooked onto the line. Okay, that's, okay. I was like, wait a second, there's something on this. The bite? Yeah, it's freaking Loch Ness. I don't see the line though, that's what I'm saying. The, the fish swam off. Got it. Oh no, it got off again. Good lord. I'm off. I was... Oh, I had another. Oh my god, you've got to be kidding me. I have a fish or what? What's going on? I got a fish. I got a fish. I think. Yeah, that's a big one. Oh, it's not that big. It's just, it's a fish though. <sighs> ha! Your boy and the camera's on too. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, look at how he ate that. He freaking ate that. Ah, oh, crap. He's gut hooked. Tying on the Biwa swim bait. This thing's got some weight to it, dude. It's an ounce. Got a rate of fall of 10 inches a second, I think. That was a huge bass, dude. It's got drawing power, that's for sure. Let me see. Big bass followed that thing out. Oh my god, Uncle Larry, this thing's huge, it's about to bite it. This thing's like a five, six pounder. Come on, you freaking giant, get this thing, man, come on. Holy crap, this is a big fish. Holy crap. Oh my god, dude. Get up here! Woo! Let's freaking go! Woo! <laughs> oh my god. He wouldn't bite the swim bait. I threw the jig and that freaking got him. <laughs> oh boy. Twenty inches. Huh? 
I'm looking for it. I can't find it. What, four? Oh, hold it. Hold it then. It's not three pounds, trust me. Yeah. Oh boy, come on. Stop moving. Stop moving. I'm throwing you back. Stop moving. See you, big brother. You see that though? He went straight to the rock. 